Hi, I'm Black Bright. Hi there and welcome to my channel. Um, thank you for subscribing. If you've subscribed, if you haven't, please do um, like and share. You know, you know, all the normal stuff that you hear vloggers say. And remember that being a subscriber does not give you license to insult or to give ne negative comments. Okay, and get personal. So anyway, today I've got a video and it's quite a, somebody sent it to me and it's about a police force and they're doing an operation on a house and I am um, surprised that they're so transparent because with the police, I would have thought that they would have to operate with a bit of discretion when they're going to a property. But I'm going to show you the um, video and... Um, yeah, I'm not quite, quite sure if I can show you all of it, but I'll show you a reasonable amount of it so you can get a good picture of what I'm talking about. We've been out on the routine patrols on Enfield Highway and we've come to an area where we've had drug dealing in the past and we've just come around the corner and done a little inspection um, and my colleague has found this rather nasty looking zombie knife that was hidden in the corner. Um, my other colleague has found another knife which was on top of this garage roof and up on the garage roof as well there was a small uh, collection of drugs and a cannabis grinder which has then led us to this garage which did have and a, the door was slightly ajar so we've entered the garage um, and secure. we found cannabis uh, paraphernalia etc um, which has then led us to this door uh, and we were just doing a quick check on the property to make sure that everyone was okay. Uh, and it was led us to this rear garden door, which was ajar. So we've entered the premises just to, again to make sure that everybody is okay and that nothing was suspicious. Police, the yeah. safety, section 17. So as we come into the building, We've stumbled across a cannabis factory, which these are the baby plants. But as you go upstairs, you can see that this is quite a rather large setup um, with almost fully grown plants. So there's one room there. You can't really appreciate the smell. And then obviously you've got one room there and you have another room there so all in all just a basic simple yeah well i didn't want to go to, didn't want to show the whole video um but yeah i'm surprised that they're allowed to do that um, I was kind of looking up on you know how police collect evidence so number one they cannot enter without the owner's permission. Um, they have to be in close pursuit of someone who's committed a crime before they go into a property. Um, they were obviously not responding to a disturbance. There was no cries for help. Um, not to enforce arrest. Oh yeah, they need to be invited in. Um, yeah, so those are the main reasons why the police would go into a property like that. And, you know, me and my suspicious mind, I just don't understand how the police would, it just doesn't seem real. Why would the police be videotaping that? You know, oh, we found this knife in a corner and we found this cannabis here. We went through this door. It was open. You know, the police aren't transparent like that. I mean, maybe they are trying to show people what can happen to um you know what could be going on next door but i just thought that was a bit too um contrived um for my liking it something just doesn't ring right about that operation i'm not sure what it is but um yeah i it just doesn't seem right you know they're, they're videoing it and they're videoing the police office and then they're showing it up on the roof and it's obviously for public consumption I don't know. Do you have any thoughts about that? I'd love to hear them. Anyway, this is short and sweet. Bye-bye.